Hi, welcome to Catech. For today's tutorial, we have another um, fillet command activity. So to start our drawing, let's set our units first. So type units in your command line. Precision is zero. Unit to scale is millimeters and then press OK. Let's start with circle type C. Diameter is 50. Another circle again with a diameter of 64. And then let's use a guideline 40. So that's our guideline for circle with a radius 8. Another line with a length of 80. And the radius of circle is 5. And then from there, let's make another guideline with the length of 20. Circle again with the diameter of 30. Up, oh, sorry, 20. And then circle with the diameter of 30. There you go. Now, we need a line for this part where we will play. So, what we do, click line, and then this is our intersection. The length is 28. Now, click the line. Use this midpoint as our displacement, and then put it in the center. Line again, we will do the same on the other side. Length is 16. Enter, click the line, midpoint, and then from there, we will connect the line for this quadrant on this one. And then for this line, is the end point. And then we will do our fillet. So the fillet is, radius is 17, so radius 17, enter. Fillet this circle and line, line and circle. Same with the other side. And then let's trim this part as well as this one. Same on the other side. And then press enter. Now we've completed our drawing. What we need to do is put our dimension. So format, dimension style. I have my dimension here already, so you can create your dimension as you like. So type new and then type the name of the new style you like and then continue. And then you can set the height, the length, the size of symbols, arrow, text, and whatever you like. Press OK when you're happy with it. And then all you need to do is you click the name and then set current and then close. Now we will do our linear dimension. Linear is for straight line horizontally and vertically. So you need to point the center to the end point to be able to determine the linear dimension. So there. Another. And then another linear for this line. We'll delete na lang the image later. Once you're done with linear, let's move on to diameter. Enter to repeat the command. And then next is the radius. Put it there. So are we complete? I guess we're complete. So we need to just delete this line. Let's lose this link as well. And this image. So there you go. We've completed another 
fillet command activity. So if you have question or suggestion, feel free to comment down below. And please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe so you will be updated for our new tutorial. Thank you for watching and God bless.